The Magical Garden Adventure Once upon a time, in a quiet neighborhood, there was a curious third grader named Mia. Mia loved exploring and discovering new things. Her favorite place in the whole world was her grandmother's backyard garden. Mia's grandmother, Granny Rose, had the most enchanting garden filled with colorful flowers, fragrant herbs, and the tallest sunflowers you could imagine. Granny Rose was a master gardener, and she loved teaching Mia all about the magic of plants. One sunny morning, Mia decided to visit Granny Rose's garden. She found Granny Rose kneeling by a bed of beautiful roses, tending to them with care. Hi, Granny Rose. Mia greeted her with a big smile. Granny Rose looked up, her eyes twinkling with a mischievous glint. Mia, I have something special to show you today. Would you like to go on a magical adventure? Mia's eyes widened with excitement. A magical adventure? Yes, please. Granny Rose reached into her gardening apron and pulled out a tiny, golden key. She led Mia to a hidden door covered in ivy at the back of the garden. The door was so small that Mia had never noticed it before. With a click of the key, Granny Rose unlocked the door, and it swung open to reveal a breathtaking world. It was a garden like no other, with plants that glowed in all the colors of the rainbow. Mia stepped inside and gasped in amazement. Wow! Granny Rose, this garden is incredible. Granny Rose smiled warmly. This is the magical part of my garden, Mia. Here, the plants come to life, and they have stories to tell. Mia and Granny Rose spent the day in the magical garden, talking to talking flowers, dancing with the wind, and even having a tea party with a friendly gnome. Mia learned about the importance of taking care of nature and how every living thing had a purpose. As the sun began to set, Mia knew it was time to go home. She said goodbye to her new friends and thanked Granny Rose for the incredible adventure. Back in the regular garden, Mia felt a sense of wonder and appreciation for nature like never before. She realized that even without magic, Granny Rose's garden was a treasure filled with beauty and life. From that day on, Mia visited Granny Rose's garden regularly, not just for the magic but to care for and learn from the plants that were there. And as she grew older, she became a master gardener herself, passing down the love and knowledge of plants to future generations. The End Mia's magical garden adventure had taught her that there was magic in the everyday world, waiting to be discovered by...